Are you serious? Hi ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy Momo FIFA HD. How are you guys doing? Today, I'm gonna talk about and react to, you know, strip FIFA video. You probably know that KSI uploaded, you know, a strip FIFA video, I think an hour or two hours ago. I watched it. I'm pretty sure you watched it too. So I'm gonna talk a little bit about it and just strip FIFA in general. In case you haven't watched it, you know, this is the video. I'm gonna link the video in my description. You can go and watch it right now. So strip FIFA, what is it? Strip FIFA is basically, you know, a competition or a challenge between a boy and a girl obviously when you know they play FIFA or open packs and the loser has to strip so if you lose you need to take a piece of clothes off and let's say you have you have four four you consider four goals or you couldn't get the best packs you need to you know take off your top whatever till we go where we have to go but strip FIFA is taboo in the FA community okay if you upload strip FIFA you're going to hell you're gonna get penetrated by every single person on Twitter in the FIFA community. But why is it that deep? That's what I'm gonna talk about today. Me personally, I like to videos like, I don't, I don't have a problem with it, okay? For example, for me it's the same thing as, you know, people using their girlfriends to do some fake pranks. I don't mind those videos. You know what? It's the internet, it's just entertainment. I don't take those things deep. I have too much problems to be caring about what a dude and his girlfriend is doing on the internet i don't care so there's a part where a dude make a video a strip club video with his girlfriend and there's another one where a guy goes and book a stripper an escort a prostitute or whatever and they make the video together i don't care either you know why because it's not my problem People want to watch it. If you look on YouTube and, and you tap Strip FIFA, millions of views every day. Why there's millions of views? Because there's demand. When there's demand, there has to be supply. Easy. So I can't be here moaning and crying because somebody made a video with a girl and the girl show not even her boobs. Because on YouTube, there's no nudity allowed on you on YouTube, okay? So the most they go, hmm, like I did it too. I can't I can show my girlfriend's boobs on how you call this like naked on the internet i can't do that but what where they go is like you know they show the girl with but the girl you know stay in her bra showing the, the, the her, her arms you know the the, the shoulders all but the bruises are covered you can show a little piece of course everybody you know you, you need to take with the viewers but that's 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 it that's that's where it goes have you seen models okay have you seen them sometimes they even pose naked Bro, you have to do what you have to do. I'm not gonna judge you for that. Like, I actually don't care what you're doing to make your money. I don't know why you need the money for. Maybe it's to feed your family. If you wanna sell drugs to feed your family, go, go, bro. Don't sell to me though. I don't smoke or I don't, I don't sniff cocaine. But go do what you have to do. If you get in trouble, it's your problem. It's your life. So for me, as long as there's no nudity, okay? Like, the person is not really naked, it's fine. Because, listen, what's the problem? You're gonna say, oh, your viewers are nine years old, your viewers are 12 years old. So they never seen boobs in their life. They never seen the up, upper side of boobs in their life. That's what you're gonna tell me today. So I'm the reason why my nine years old subscribers that you claim they are, are seen boobs for the first time. <coughs> GG. Another thing, I guess my girlfriend, if she goes to the beach and she's showing, you know, people her, her, her body half naked and stuff. Oh, she's a whole oh, oh, oh. that girl is not supposed. You need to be dressed like you're going to the office when you're going to the beach. So she's a whole just because she, you know there's a little piece of her book showing, a little bit of her ass showing. She's a prostitute. She's the worst girl ever. She has no self-respect. Yes, that's what how that's how people react on Twitter when they see a strip for video. Second thing. They're gonna say, oh, you using your girlfriend for views. Oh my god, you such a whore. Cheap views every day. Shut the hell up. We all know on YouTube when you put your girlfriend in a video or you make a video with your girlfriend, it, it, it like it double your views or even triple or four times because people wanna see females, okay? Because people love those things, okay? They wanna see females in your videos. So even without doing street for okay, so you can say QA with your girlfriend. You're using your girlfriend to get used to. 
So if you want people to stop doing stream FIFA, you too do not put your girlfriend in your video because you know damn well but your views are gonna go up. Let's just be honest with each other. So if you think putting your girlfriend in a video, doing stream FIFA, taking off her clothes and staying in her, you know, in her bras is cheap views and is not honorable and it's for to get views, then don't you need to tell the same thing to people who put their girlfriends in the videos too because it's gonna get pretty much the same results. Girlfriend videos get millions of views every day. I think I think I think I've said everything I have to say. Let me know in the comment section what you think all stupid for guys because me, that's my position and I stick to it. That's my opinion. Let people do what they have to do. It's not against the YouTube community guideline. As long as the person is not naked, YouTube is fine with it. So what's your problem? Are you YouTube? No, you're not. First of all. And KSI, about KSI's video, he's he's one of the reasons why I started YouTube. G J No, what's his name though? JJ or GG? J GG to him, JJ, okay? GG to JJ. Because, like, he doesn't care. That's why I like the guy. You see what you think? He doesn't give a damn about it. That's why I like KSI for. So, my whole point in this video is just because somebody and his girlfriend are doing a strip challenge doesn't mean they, they, they don't have self respect or whatever. It's entertaining and something fun they, they want to do for the, for the viewers. Is it your problem? Mind your business. For example, in my case, my girlfriend, she feels comfortable, okay? Like some people think we force the girls to do the video. Are you out of your brain? We in 2015, who forced girls? You go to jail, okay? I'm pretty sure all those YouTubers who made videos with their girlfriends, true FIFA videos, those girlfriends feel comfortable in themselves, showing their body and stuff. Easy! Okay, go on Instagram. You're gonna see them half naked anyway. Does, does it mean they have no self-respect? No. You just you just being something. I don't know what type of human being you are, to be honest. So that's my opinion. If you hate it, it's up to you. Stick to your opinion or stick to mine. But for me, strip FIFA videos, I will hit the like button. If you follow me on Twitter, you will see that I hit the like button. Because I don't want a lot of problems. I always stay in my, you know, in my lane. But people always try to pull up on me. That's why I hit them with the people's elbow every day when you're attacking me. You're gonna get hit with the people's elbow. At the end of the day, we're just here to entertain people. If people want to watch it, there's people who's gonna make it. As I said, demand equals supply. So it's gonna happen. You, you, you better just cry or leave the internet if you don't like true FIFA because it's gonna happen. I'm probably gonna make another one. Maybe one day. I don't know, but I don't feel ashamed of doing true FIFA. No. So yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about true FIFA. KSI, I'm happy for that video. I'm really happy. And I follow the girl as well. She's nice. Yeah. So follow me on Twitter and Instagram if you want. If you have something to say, I'll reply to you. See you tomorrow for another video, guys. Stay safe. Peace. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Just hit that like button. I know you like watching. I know you like watching. Just hit that like button. 1,000 likes. 2,000 likes. 3,000 likes. Make sure you definitely like, like it. Oh, uh, hit the like button, hit the like button. Hit it, hit it. I know that you enjoyed the video. Why don't you just hit the like button? Hit it, hit it. Hit the like button, hit the like button, hit the like button. Pow, pow. If you don't hit the like button, there will be a lot of problems. A lot of problem. You don't want a lot of problem.